home stuck high. A dramatic reading by me, Little Miss Rexy Bear. Hi guys, uh, this is my first fanfic. I really hope you all enjoy it. I'm writing it on not pad, but me friend Betta read it for me. <laughs> home stuck forever. This spring fling was next week and John didn't have a date. He really liked Rose, however. He had liked her since second grade when she bit his arm and broke his glasses and made him cry. He took his books out of his locker and seen Rose walking towards him. He got really nervous and began to sweat. Hey Rose, he said blankly. Uh, what do you want, loser? She replied coldly. I wanted to know if you wanted to go to the dance with me. John said. Okay, Rose said. But if someone hotter than you asks me, then I'm gonna go with them. That's okay, John said. And just then the school's goth kid, Gamzee, came up to talk to them. Hey Rose, Gamzee seed. I like totally love your hair. Why well, look amazing to get at the spring flop next week? You should go with me. I just asked you, you got freak. John proclaimed loudly. Well, you're no god for Rose. Rose is a beauty like no other Rose can compare. I deserve to go with her more than you do. And you, you guys, Rose described looking from John to Hamzy. Why don't you both take me to the spring flame next week? We could be a threesome. Okay. John and Gamzy agreed in unicorns. On the weekend, Rose went sh shopping with Jane and Ferrari to pick a dress. They got ready together at Jane's house. Rose was wearing a mini length leather tight dress which came up to her knees like one of those pencil skirts and it hugged a small frame tightly. It had no straps and it was held up by her boobies. It was bright green and it showed off her clevers. She bought a knee high leather black boots that had riddles in them and were four inches off of the ground with a pointy toe. She wore her hair up in kind of a messy bun, bun with her bangs just below her eyebrows. She was wearing black eyeliner and bright red lipstick. She was also wearing a fake tan. OMG, you look so hot, Rose. I would totally want to sex you. Jade said as she smacked Rose's ass. You look hot too, Jade. I bet Dave will totally want to sex you too. Rose discriminated. Do you think so? She blushed. I'm a virgin, though. Don't worry. He likes virgins. Ferrari said. Riska told me, I'm Tia. Riska slept with Dave. Jade ejaculated. But he didn't like it because she wasn't a virgin. Ferrari conjured. Oh, okay. Jade counted. They all went to the party and everyone was there. Everyone danced with one another. The lights were flickering up between all different colors. All the different cliques were dancing together and it was really good. Dave ended up taking Jade early and Rose gave her a wink. But Riska was jealousy. She wanted Dave for herself and didn't like them together. <laughs> Rose, John said seriously, I think I'm in love with you. I'm J. John. Rose declaration, I think I'm in lust with you too. Yay. They both said, oh gee, you guys, Carcat just killed himself. Gansy pro climbed. Hee <laughs> hee, a cliffhanger. I hope you enjoyed it. Please review. And on Rose Declaration. I think I would lust with you too.